Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today we will be sculpting a seashell and pearl just because I like prolonging the summer a little longer. Hope you like it. I stacked a couple of thick sheets of scrap clay and traced the design. Then I removed the excess clay. from the areas where the seashell is thinner. After smoothing the clay with your fingers, you want to begin tracing the lines all converging towards the center of the narrow end. When you get to those little wings of the scallop, keep the lines horizontal or almost perpendicular to those on the shell. Add texture with a toothbrush. To avoid getting square edges, I used a small bowl tool to soften and round the clay. Then bake. Make a mold from mold putty and cover the shell only once it's cooled down. Let it sit for a few minutes before you remove the shell. I rolled out a sheet of translucent white clay and placed it in the mould, making sure to get to every detail by pushing the clay evenly with a large ball tool and my fingers. Then I removed the excess clay with a blade and baked it for about 25 to 30 minutes. To 
Take the pearl, just start from a ball of translucent white clay and roll it unevenly. You can either add it to the shell now, bonding with a bit of liquid clay or glue it later. Once baked and cooled, remove the shell from the mould and file some edges if necessary. To add colour I used mica powders mixed with glaze but you can also use acrylic paints in any colour you want. I used pink, purple and a bluish green I mixed myself. Once the glaze had dried, I glued on the pearl and painted it with pearl mica powders mixed with glaze. And your seashell is complete. I really hope you're having or had a great summer. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you all soon. Bye! Ciao ciao!